Hey, this is Mark Swarson from MTC Media Network. UVA um, has found out who they're going to play in the inaugural uh, a, uh, U, uh, ACC SEC Challenge. Uh, they will be playing Texas A&M. Um, the Cavaliers will be looking to bounce back after an unexpected first round loss to Furman. And there's going to be three things I'm going to be looking for, not only in that game, but uh, for the entire year, starting with can Reese Beekman be the focal point of the offense with the roster around him. The Cavaliers are going to need for him to average in double digits, especially when you consider um, some of the roster changes that have happened either the graduation or through transfers. Second, uh, Isaac McNeely, will he be an effective, efficient threat when he's asked to play a bigger role in the offense and people will know he's coming and he can't play off of guys. That's usually a transition. Now, some players in college transition to it seamlessly. We'll see um, how that works out for McNeely. And last but not least, um, after taking a season off at Georgetown, can Dante Harris lead UVA's offense? It's hard to tell. I cover Georgetown, and uh, we haven't seen him in a year. And can he duplicate what he did when he was a freshman and Georgetown made that surprising uh, Big East run? Uh, and can he play it in UVA system? I think UVA system actually will help Harris um, compared to some of the things Patrick Ewing uh, wanted to do. So, it, But it's big. There's still, still a lot of questions about that. So we'll have to see how Tony Bennett handles it. So this is Marcus Watson from MTC Media Network.